Good afternoon. I'm Barrett Gunderson, Dean of the Thomas J. Long School of Pharmacy. Welcome to the Hooding and Diploma Ceremony for the University of the Pacific School of Pharmacy, Class of 2023. To begin this joyous event, it is my honor to introduce Dr. William Chan, Professor of Pharmaceutics and Medicinal Chemistry, and your runner-up Teacher of the Year to give the invocation. I ask that if you can stand, please do so. Please join me in a moment of thanksgiving as we begin the celebration of our graduates' accomplishments. Let us pray. Our Father in heaven, we thank you because you have blessed us with an opportunity to celebrate this occasion in the lives of our graduates. Our graduates are full of joy and relief for, the, for this milestone in their lives. We are so thankful for the love and support that family and friends, faculty and staff have given them during the years in pharmacy school. Allow us the blessing of giving back more than we have received. Today, family and friends are overjoyed with the accomplishment of our graduates. We want to remain faithful to them as they continue a life of healthcare service to others. As faculty and staff of Pacific, we are thankful that we were allowed to guide, nurture, and support our graduates along the way. We will continue to be a source of help when they need it. This is the beginning of a new chapter in the lives of our graduates, marked by faithful service to humankind lives distinguished by lifelong pursuit of learning better serve those who have entrusted to their care. Let them be a source of help to others. We are in need for his glory. For this and your many other blessings, we truly give thanks. Amen. Please be seated. Congratulations, graduates. We are all here today. Administration, faculty, staff, alumni, family, students, and friends to celebrate your accomplishments. For the full schedule of our program, it can be found on page 20 of the commencement program that you all have received. We have a number we have a number of honored distinguished guests from the university joining us today. Please stand when I read your name and remain standing to be recognized. The Honorable Con Consuelo Maria Callahan, Regent, Dr. Elizabeth Johnson, Regent and Pharmacy Alumna Class of 1987, Christopher Callahan, President, Rob Henderson, Interim Chief Information Officer. Mike Clocky, Interim Associate Vice President for Strategic Communication. Dr. James Wall, President of the Pacific Pharmacy Alumni Association and a Pharmacy Alumnus Class of 2016. Also on the stage and scattered throughout our audience are the faculty of the Thomas J. Long School of Pharmacy. These are the faculty who have inspired and supported our graduates on their journey to become pharmacists. Would the faculty please stand and the audience join me in thanking them.
Our graduates have worked tremendously hard to get here today. And we know that many people, the family and friends that were there along the way to support them through the challenging times and to celebrate the successes. On this day when we are celebrating successes, I ask the family and friends of our graduates to please stand if you are able so that your graduates and our school can recognize your contributions to their achievements. Please rise. Come on, family, friends, yeah! <laughs> you. So class of 2023, today is your day. We are very happy for you, proud to call you graduates, and on this monumentous day, I want to remind you about your Pacific roots and how important you are to the university. Since the first students matriculated from the university, we still march to the cadence of, of a legacy of excellence. We travel a path that has a proud and strong foundation forged with a creative vision. A vision that we hold just as dear today as when it was formulated. Pacific is an educational institution that holds two unwavering yet interconnected basic principles. Affirming the individual worth and fostering unique talents of every graduate so that they can live, learn, and lead with purpose. Connecting the efforts of the school to the professions that we are a part of so that our graduates can make a positive impact in their careers and to the communities that they serve. Your graduation from Pacific is the start of a lifelong commitment to excellent service and purpose. It is important for each of you to fully realize that the school and the university are here for you now and will be here for you through the entirety of your career. As you wish to be in contact with your classmates, as you need to network with others in the field, as you require updates in our discipline, Pacific will be here. We view the responsibility to support your professional growth as continuing lifelong commitment that will enable each of you to achieve your full potential. So venture out confidently that your Pacific family is here for you and that your bond with Pacific will endure everywhere life takes you. It is now my pleasure to introduce our first Dr. Pharmacy student speaker, Dr. Benson Lung. Hello. And thank you, family, friends, and loved ones, for joining us today. And thank you, Dean Gunderson, for the introduction. My name is Benson Lung, and I've had the privilege of serving as the president of the American Pharmacists Association Academy of Student Pharmacists. I'm delighted to have this opportunity to speak on behalf of the class of 2023. These past three years have definitely been quite the experience, with many of the things being upended and turned upside down due to the COVID-19 pandemic. And as we began our pharmacy journey, with classes being completely virtual, we were plagued with uncertainty, lack of direction, and all around fear of what was to come. Despite this ambiguity, we were able to learn, adapt, and persevere. And with the help of faculty, staff, peers, preceptors, as well as family and friends, we were able to dive headfirst into the COVID-19 pandemic. And as new incoming students, we were able to play a critical role in coordinating COVID clinics and health fairs to provide services to those that needed it most. Under the leadership of Dr. Veronica Bandy, Carissa Learn, and Talara Yetanekian, Operation Immunization hosted more than 30 clinics and administered nearly 10,000 vaccine doses 
on the Stockton campus between January 2021 and June 2022. Our combined efforts led us to receive the 2021 Faith Davies Student Organization of the Year Award, as well, being, as, well as being acknowledged by the California Pharmacists Association for Chapter of Excellence in 2022. When we were unable to provide face-to-face -face care, we pivoted and provided our services virtually. Moreover, we used this opportunity to expand our care to further, service, to further serve the underserved and underrepresented uh, populations, and especially those who had limited transportation. And when circumstances allowed, we worked tirelessly to transition our events back in person, with patient safety being our first priority. Our class is unique in that we were able to persevere through the entirety of a pandemic in our three years here and ultimately leave our mark in history. We will remember our time here as student advocates working together to advance the profession of pharmacy. And this success would not have been possible without the support from all of you, our family and friends. And today, as our PharmD journey at Pacific comes to an end, we begin the next chapter of our lives as Pacific alumni and working professionals. And in conclusion, I will leave you all with one of my life mottos. Never get held back by your past mistakes, but instead reflect and bring with you the lessons you learned to forge a better tomorrow. And so, I implore all of you that if you fall, fall forward into the future and take with you the experiences you've gathered here. No matter where you end up, we will always be a family. Congratulations, class of 2023. We did it. We have come to what I think is everyone's favorite part of the ceremony, and that is the hooding. So to ensure balance between enthusiasm for your graduate and respect for other graduates, um, along with your safety, I have a couple of housekeeping things I need to remind you of. First, we do have a photographer who will be taking pictures of each graduate as they receive their diploma cover. And I know that many of you will also wish to take pictures, but you will not be allowed on the floor or in front of the platform. And again, because of fire code, you're not to stand in the aisles or on the concourse. During the presentation of graduates, we strongly encourage your expression of pride by applauding and cheering and just overall celebrations. And we ask for safety reasons that you don't use the air horns or noisemakers. So thank you in advance for your cooperation. Okay, so now the good part, what to expect. When receiving a master's or doctoral degree, graduates are traditionally draped with a hood during this formal part of the ceremony. The different colors correspond to the type of doctoral degree, with the blue representing the PhD and the olive green representing the PharmD. So participating along with me in presenting diplomas and hooding the graduates this afternoon are student leaders and faculty from within the school and university and they are listed in the program's special acknowledgements if you wish to review their names. We will begin with the hooding of the graduates of the Pharmaceutical and Chemical Sciences program. Graduates are hooded by their dissertation advisor, and assisting me in congratulating the graduates is Dr. Bhaskara Josti. Will the graduates receiving their Doctor of Philosophy in Pharmaceutical and Chemical Sciences please follow the di directions of faculty marshals and when instructed to do so, stand and proceed to a uh, platform for hooding. When I read your name, proceed to your major advisor to be hooded, then proceed to the dean to receive your diploma.
Dr. Muhammad Anisur Rahman. We will now begin the hooding graduates for the Doctor of Pharmacy degree. Graduates will be hooded by their faculty, and assisting me in congratulating the graduates will be Dr. Chara Jenkins and Dr. Jim Uchizono. Will those graduates receiving their Doctor of Pharmacy degree please follow the directions of the faculty marshals, and when instructed to do so, please stand proceed to the platform to be hooded. When Dr. Uchizono and I read your name, please proceed to one of the members to be uh, hooded, and then over here to the dean to receive your diploma. Dr. Manal Abdel Shahid. Dr. Yao Ung, cum laude. Dr. Inga Aaron Labadal, magna cum laude. Dr. Jeffrey Batista, cum laude. Dr. Jamila Malarbia. Dr. Ashley Byer, cum laude. Dr. Kenneth Bunzier. Dr. Kyle Bui. Dr. Nee Bowie. Dr. Dopinder Putar. Dr. Sarah Delfina Casillas. Dr. Umir Chuda. Dr. Allison Chan, graduating. <laughs> graduating summa cum laude. Allison is the recipient of the Walter Kuhr Clinical Drug Information Award of Excellence in Clinical Communication and Merck and Company Incorporated Award. Dr. Chuk Fong Chan, cum laude. Dr. Celine Marie Chandler. 
graduating cum laude. Celine is a recipient of the American Pharmacists Association Academy of Student Pharmacists Senior Recognition Award, the San Joaquin Pharmacists Association Norman Silver Scholarship, and the Spirit of Pacific Award. Dr. Allison Chang. Dr. Jeffrey Chang. Dr. Jeffrey Chan, summa cum laude. Jeffrey is the recipient of Excellence in Patient Advocacy Award and the Merck and Company Incorporated Award. Congratulations. Dr. Jun Wei Chan. Dr. Karen Chen, magna cum laude. Dr. Christina Chu, graduating cum laude. Dr. Ashley Chow. Dr. Gabriel Chokro. Dr. Braden Dahl. Dr. Dustin Dang. Dr. Ryan Dang. Dr. Win T. Dang, graduating magna cum laude. Dr. Eric Daniels. Dr. Ashley Doss. Dr. Kenneth Edward Dotto. Dr. Russell Michael D. Dr. Cherry Dang. Summa cum laude, graduating with highest GPA in the class, Cherry's recipient of the Rokai Honor Award and Beatrice Excellence in Pharmacy Award. Congratulations. Dr. Ravneet Dami, graduating cum laude. Dr. Tarnvir Dillon, cum laude. Dr. Marion Ferhadian. <laughs> Dr. Juan Carlos Reyes Fernandez. <laughs> Dr. Lorraine Faust. <laughs> Dr. Kathleen Ghani, cum laude. <laughs> Recipient of the Helen Rowland Memorial Scholarship Award. <laughs> Dr. Tamina Gobadi. <laughs> Dr. Karen Yang, magna cum laude. Recipient of the Merck and Company Incorporated Award. Congratulations. Dr. Nicolette Jorgis, magna cum laude. Dr. Miriam Gurgis. Dr. 
Dr. Salamia Golemguk, sorry, Gomenguk, cum laude. Dr. Athena Hagen. Dr. Jane Ham, graduating cum laude. Dr. Chu Hang. <laughs> Dr. Gojubin Hayer. Dr. Joshua Ho, magna cum laude. Dr. Sam Hung, graduating cum laude. Dr. Katrina Hua, magna cum laude. Dr. Carrie Huang. Dr. Derek Huang, cum laude. Dr. Hui Ling Hong, graduating summa cum laude and graduating with the highest class GPA. Congratulations. Dr. Dry Yi Wang. Dr. Valerie Hui. Dr. Insong Wang. Dr. Noah Jakala. Noah is the recipient of the Excellence in Innovation Award. Dr. Harneet Kaur. Dr. Navdeep Kaur. Dr. Bora Kim. Dr. Sherry Kim, graduating magna cum laude. Dr. Elaine Kim, magna cum laude. Dr. Jared Kim. Dr. Clara Kim, cum laude, recipient of the California Society Health Systems Pharmacist Valley Award. Congratulations. Dr. Rebecca Kim. Dr. Yena Kim. Dr. Grace Ko. Dr. Vaishnavi Kohli, magna cum laude. Dr. Chris Koshi Nibud, graduating cum laude. Dr. Ryan Sumhe Kwang, cum laude. Thank you. 
Dr. Hannah Lee. Dr. Hunju Lee. Dr. Raina Lee. Dr. Benson Lung. Recipient of the Academy of Student Pharmacists Mortar and Pestle Professionalism Award. Congratulations. Dr. Carissa Learn. Carissa is the recipient. Carissa is the recipient of the Excellence in National and International Contributions Award. Congratulations. Dr. Vivian Lee. Dr. Redmond Lee, graduating cum laude. Dr. Ryan Lin. Dr. Edric Leong. Dr. Claire Liu. Dr. Faith Long, graduating cum laude. Dr. Cesar Lopez. <laughs> Dr. Evelyn Mancha. Dr. Sean McNary, magna cum laude, recipient of the Excellence Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion Award and the Merck Award. Congratulations. Dr. Kenya Medina, graduating cum laude. Dr. Vargas McCurchian. Shanisha May Nellis. Dr. Samantha Ng. Dr. Brianna Nguyen. Dr. Emma Wynn. Dr. Heidi Wynn, graduating magna cum laude. Dr. Ken Wynn. Dr. Mai Nguyen, Mai Nguyen. Dr. Trang Nguyen, graduating summa cum laude. Trang is a recipient of the Merkin Company Incorporated Award. Congratulations. Dr. Ashley Nam, summa cum laude. Dr. Taylor Okazaki, cum laude. Dr. Edward Pomanian, graduating cum laude. Dr. Steve Parathu, summa cum laude. Dr. 
Jonathan Paredes. Okay, Dr. Allison Park. Anything possible, right? Dr. Anjali Sunil Patel. <laughs> Dr. Matissa Peng. Dr. Alex Pham, cum laude. Dr. Ann Pham. Dr. Samantha Pham. Dr. Jocelyn Quach. Dr. Julia Ramos Martinez. <laughs> Dr. Jasmine Ramsey. Dr. Tiger Saley, cum laude, recipient of the Excellence in Dedication Award. Congratulations. Dr. Angela San. Dr. Jasmine Sandu. Dr. Tyler Sekigahama. Dr. Samantha Sito, graduating magna cum laude. Dr. Celine Shen. Dr. Hina Singh. Dr. Madeline Sun, graduating summa cum laude. Dr. Eugene Song. Dr. Umin Singh Tatla, cum laude. Dr. Alexander Tai. Dr. Victoria Tai. Dr. Alexandra Tran, cum laude. Dr. Ann Tran, graduating cum laude. Ann is a recipient of the Excellence in Building Community Award. Congratulations.
Dr. Arthur Van Tran. Dr. Chloe New Tran. Dr. Emily Lynn Tran. Dr. Quinn Tran. Dr. Sarah Tran, cum laude, recipient of the Excellence in Promoting Unity and Service Award. Congratulations. Dr. Victor Tran, graduating magna cum laude. Dr. Mimi Nak Trung. Dr. Michaela Turingen. Dr. Janice Feng. Dr. Star Lashia Vang, graduating cum laude. Dr. Catherine Vo, cum laude. Dr. Lynette Vong. Dr. Jessica Vong, cum laude. Tanner Weaver, graduating summa cum laude. Tanner is a recipient of the Excellence in Youth Mentorship Award. Congratulations. Dr. Crystal Wong, magna cum laude, recipient of the California Health Systems Pharmacist Central Valley Award. Diana Michelle Wong. Dr. Young Wong. Dr. Cheyenne Wu, graduating cum laude. Dr. Li Zhang, cum laude. Dr. Chua Yang. Dr. Joni Yang. Dr. Talar Yetnekian. Dr. Bill Zhang. Dr. Jania Zhu, graduating cum laude.
Congratulations, class of 2023. This ceremony is a culmination of a multi-year journey that our graduates have taken with the faculty, preceptors, and staff of the school. These individuals have served as teachers, mentors, and trusted advisors to the students in the class of 2023. And on behalf of everyone, we congratulate you and hope the special bond that was forged through Pacific will carry on for many years to come. At this time, I would like to invite your class president, Win Yu Jenny Lee, to share a few words with you. Dr. Lee. <laughs> Hello and welcome family, friends, faculty, staff, and administrators. Thank you for being here today to help celebrate a great milestone in our lives. My name is Chenju Jenny Lee, and I've had the honor of serving as the second year class representative. First and foremost, I'd like to express how proud I am to stand alongside our generation of pharmacists. We've come a very long way, and we've been through a lot to say the least. Starting pharmacy school through Zoom was one of our first challenges. We had to adjust to a new classroom setting, avoid distractions, and find our own motivation every day for us to focus on our studies. We then had to pivot to in-person classes, retrain ourselves to rely less on lecture recordings, and learn to embrace the 50-degree weather of PHS. Moreover, we had to re-engage in social events, wearing actual clothes other than our pajamas and sweats, and refrain from introducing ourselves as, can you guys hear me? <laughs> Throughout rotations, not only did we experience different aspects of pharmacy practice, um, but we also learned more about ourselves, how to receive constructive feedback, and more importantly, how to transform our weaknesses into our strengths. Over the last three years, we've overcome many obstacles, um, and I think that we've demonstrated what it means to be resilient. I believe that we will carry on these lessons with us as we um, proceed in our careers, whether it be straight into the workforce or into residency or fellowship. On the behalf of <clears throat> the class of 2023, I want to thank our professors, preceptors, staff, and administrators for constructing a rigorous but rewarding curriculum. At this moment, I'd also like to thank our family and friends who have supported us through it all, um, lifted us up at our lows, <laughs> and are here today to celebrate us at our highs. <laughs> um, so with the support from everyone here, <laughs> oh my goodness, <laughs> I believe that we are ready to serve um, diverse patient populations. <laughs> <clears throat> As skilled clinicians. So today we recognize the diligence, work ethic, and unparalleled drive of our generation of pharmacists. Um, and together we celebrate the beginning of a meaningful journey ahead. Congratulations, class of 2023. Thank you. <laughs> This 
This is the point in our ceremony where we ask the graduates of the Doctor of Pharmacy program to swear their intent to support the ethics and principles of the pharmacy profession. To lead our new Doctor of Pharmacy graduates in reciting their professional oath, it is my pleasure to introduce Dr. Carly Ranson, the 2023 Teacher of the Year. Will just the candidates for the Doctor of Pharmacy degree rise and read along with me? Can't believe we have to do this. The oath of the pharmacist, graduates, you will find the oath on the inside of your diploma cover. And begin. I promise to devote myself to a lifetime of service to others through the profession of pharmacy. Suffering my primary concerns. I will promote inclusion, embrace diversity, and advocate for justice to advance health equity. I will apply my knowledge, experience, and skills to the best of my ability to assure optimal outcomes for all patients. I will respect and protect all personal and health information entrusted to me. I will accept the responsibility to improve my professional knowledge, expertise, and self-awareness. I will hold myself and my colleagues to the highest principles of our profession's moral, ethical, and legal conduct. I will embrace and advocate change that improve patient care. I will utilize my knowledge, skills, experiences, and values to prepare the next generation of pharmacists. I take these vows voluntarily with the full realization of the responsibility with which I am entrusted by the public. Graduates, please be seated and congratulations. I would like to now ask Dr. James Wall, class of 2020, 2016, and the president of the Pacific Pharmacist Association. Let me try that again. <laughs> Dr. Wall is class of 2016. I almost made him join your class again. And the president of the Pacific Pharmacy Alumni Association, Dr. Wall. Thank you, Dean. On behalf of the alumni of this great institution, I welcome you to this alumni family. I use the word family because it really means that we are all connected by the relationships, endeavors, and education that we experienced under one roof, the Thomas J. Long School of Pharmacy. This university, the school, and the gifts of friendship knowledge and wisdom we received here will forever connect us as a family. Just as we will continue to be a place of familiar strength when you need us, you will be called upon again and again to help and support those who come after you. Bear in mind that the wonderful things you learn are the work of many generations. All this is put in your hands today as your inheritance in order that you may receive it, honor it, add to it, and one day pass it on to those who follow you. I invite you to stay with us as we continue to strengthen this homestead, our alma mater, and continue to build and support a top pharmacy school that produces caring, skilled professionals of the highest quality. Stay with us as we celebrate our accomplishments, honor our history, nurture our family, and support our initiatives. Graduates, congratulations, and welcome to this great family of alumni. We know that you will honor this legacy with the same pride, professionalism, humility, and care that your own families and the school have provided to you. Thank you. Many students, staff,
have graciously agreed to serve as ushers and to provide support for today's events. The students are members of the Kappa Psi fraternity and the ASP leaders. I want to thank them and the staff from the school and the university for all the time and effort they put into making this such a special event for us all. So thank you. At this time, I would like to invite Dr. William Chan to return to the podium for the benediction. This is a joyous occasion. Let us come together in prayer again. Let us pray. As this commencement is coming to an end, let us remember that this is also a new beginning. New things are to come. Let us live with a spirit of gratitude for the accomplishments of our graduates and their preparation for service and leadership. The Lord our God who is among you is a great and awesome God. Because he lives, I can face tomorrow. Because he, because he lives, all fear is gone. Because I know he holds the future and life is worth the living just because he lives. May God help us to live a life with purpose. May God help us to always be ready to serve others with the gifts he has given us. Amen. Thank you, Dr. Chan. And now I invite you all to join us for Pacific Hail. This, um, the words are on the back of your uh, program. We have reached the end of the Class of 2023 Hooding Ceremony of the Thomas J. Long School of Pharmacy. I ask the audience to please remain seated until all of the graduates have left the building. I want to thank you all for being here with us today to celebrate this monumentous occasion. And I wish you all the very best as you move forward from the space. But before we recess, can we give one more huge round of applause to these graduates? <laughs> <laughs>